In this short video on meditation, I'm going to bring together a number of different topics. So the topic of intentionality and the topics of activity and receptivity. So when you're meditating, the theme of your intention, like being present, for example, or engaging with being for your welfare, are your general direction. And you can assert those uh, directions with periodically dropping in a word like being for, or for my health, or the breath. They give you the, your general direction. As well as using this sort of gentle, subtle thought to give you direction, you can also use it to open you to qualities that are here and that you need. And this is done in the form of a question. So when you're actually meditating, you can train yourself to drop in very subtle, quiet questions that don't interfere with your sense of presence. They don't take you away from your experience, but they happen, as it were, simultaneously to your experience. And you can just drop in what's here. And this sort of general question opens your mind up. Or you could Another example of that is, how does it feel? Or, what's it like? Now, that question, what's it like, is what I call a metaphoric question. And it's involving the imagination. So, you might feel it's like a volcano about to explode or it's like a flowing river, or it's like uh, water that's still and stagnant and not moving, or it's like an ocean that's deep and vibrant uh, and alive. So this metaphor can help you, that help you engage with the quality. It's very direct actually, but like all uh, faculties like the thinking faculty and the imagination faculty are double-edged. They, the imagination or the the metaphoric question, can help you get in touch with qualities, but it can also stimulate fantasy. So you have to be very aware and diligent to uh, avoid that propensity. But nevertheless asking this kind of question, what's it like, can get you more in touch with something that's very fine, very subtle and difficult to perceive with uh, ordinarily or with the thinking mind. Now these questions, what's here, what's it like, uh, what do I need, uh, are very evocative and they open you up. They, they are in a way a stimulus to the quality of openness and a genuine curiosity. Now one of the uh, qualities of openness is that it's open. It's not saying I'll be open to this but not that. It's just open. So if you ask yourself in the meditation, what's here? Then that is an invitation to be open to everything that's here. And so there's a, as in a way, a sort of courage in this, that you are going to really be open and take in whatever is here. And this deepens your sense of presence. Because when you're holding things back from yourself, then there's energy which is locked up 
closed down, disengaged. But when you become more open, that energy becomes freer, more light and open, and you yourself become more energized and brighter and lighter. So these questions are very important in the process of engaging with what's here and keeping your continuity of purpose.